everyone, this is Garrett, and this is powered by Unreal Technology, which is very loud. And it's also Viscera Cleanup something or another, made by RuneStorm. I have actually forgotten the name of the game, but apparently it's still a work in progress, and it had the word Santa in it. Viscera Cleanup Detail, Santa's Rampage. I bought this game because it had the word Santa in it, and I didn't have any Christmas games, and then this game came out and was really cheap, and it said it had physics, so... Yeah, that's that's all I know about the game, <laughs> essentially. So we're just gonna get this going. Name, that's... I actually changed this in the menu, but I guess I only changed it for multiplayer. Ages. <laughs> Not quite. An occupation is a sanitation engineer. And to brief the tragic events that unfolded at this workshop must in no way deter you from performing your duties as a man of benefiting the company's reputation. Your work here entails cleaning up the horrific aftermath of Mr. Claw's unfortunate breakdown. This includes the obvious slaughter and any broken items and so forth. Please conduct yourself appropriately as the assignment will reflect upon your permanent record. Fail to follow company guidelines and regulations and you may find yourself without a job. Oh no. Once your assignment is complete, the corporation will take ownership of the workshop and any remaining items and employees. So yeah, we are here to clean up after Santa. Went mad, even though he has some lovely pictures of cats everywhere. And to do so, we have this mop. We also have hands. They allow us to do grabbing type things. I don't know how much we can actually do with this, but... You can pick up this hat. So that's pretty cool. And then you can put it right with the left mouse button. And you can just fling it away like it's nothing. Activate. Punch out as your general the requirements of the company. I haven't actually done anything yet, so I guess not quite. Eh, yeah. We're just gonna go ahead and clean. Oh, jeez. <laughs> uh, mate, mate, we're... Okay, I need a... I need a bucket. God, what is happening here? Uh, but yeah, this, this seems like a pretty Christmassy game to me. I mean, there's a bunch of hats everywhere and a bunch of elves. His elves is not looking so good. But, you know... Overall, I, I would say he's doing pretty well. I can't really tell what's going on in this painting, but... I guess this is like a suit of armor that's gone a bit evil, but, you know... That's what Santa has to deal with. You have to abide by the wishes of your clientele, which is children everywhere. Can I throw this in here? Hands off. Wait, what does that say? Worst Fest? <laughs> Excellent. The 93 Sausage Festival. It was a fine festival, with the finest of German sausages. Can I close this thing? There we go. I think uh, we can probably do some pretty good cleaning around here, but... I'm just gonna play around. This is basically just me getting a... This is pretty much my Christmas present, because any game which is pretty much about physics and... probably not much else, <laughs> and also doesn't cost very much, is pretty much aimed towards all of my needs in a video game, which is... It has physics, and I can play around with it. And I can have little hats. Yeah, this, uh... I think they're gonna be pretty pleased. Once, uh... <laughs> whoever opens this box is gonna be like, Yep, that's clean. He, he carefully sorted all of it in a nice box. Uh, yeah, lovely. Let's close it. Perfect. No one would see any different. Not really sure what this bloom is going on here, but... Oh, no, it's opening again. Close. No! I need you to close forever. Eh. Well, that was an interesting physics, but... There you go. Oh, no. Personal property of janitor. Hands off. Oh, God. It's just not closing at all. Maybe I need to put less stuff in it. Maybe I'll just remove one elf. Ah! God, that was terrifying. The controls... <laughs> like, with the left mouse button, you sort of... Anything that's not right in front of you gets spun in the right way, I guess. But, God, it is kind of scary when suddenly a decapitated head start looking at you <laughs> without you really expecting it. Yeah, I don't think this is going to properly close ever. That's a bit unfortunate, but it, it sort of looks closed now, so I'll just... Uh, it says disposal bin, so that, that should be good. Ah! Still scared <laughs> by the scary effects of things suddenly being spun in the right way. I'm so used to games like Amnesia or Penumbra where it's like you have to manually rotate everything and in this game it's just one click and it's like bop right in your face. I'm not really sure what I'm doing. <laughs> it says disposal bins. I'm not really sure if I'm using it properly but what are you gonna do? Let's 
Maybe there's like a button here somewhere that I can push. What was that? Oh. oh. Uh, yeah, that's. Uh, oh god, is there an elf? There's an elf stuck in the box. <laughs> well, I'm, it, it's disposed of. Let's, uh. I wonder if we can get more of these disposal boxes from this thing. Oh. Maybe we can get every elf. Oh no, what is going on? It's coming to life! <laughs> oh. Um. Well. That was such a good disposal box that it removed the elf from this entire plane of existence, so. I would say it's done a pretty good job in that case. But, whoa! Man, this thing is just going crazy once it reaches terminal velocity like it sometimes does. Ooh. Let's see if I can do that again. Like, I guess I just need to have it sort of in odd position. I can't let go of it anymore. <laughs> okay, there we go. I think I was just pressing the wrong button or something. God, this is the most terrifying visage. But that's why I'm the viscera cleaning detail, of course. What are these books? Uh, shoot it. A modern guide to... These are really small letters. Guide to... <laughs> Retail economics. Blood everywhere. Uh, hmm, actually. I wonder if I could sort of push this back in. Elf, just please. Get... Perfect. Okay. Let's see if I can... Oh, no. <laughs> it just got destroyed. Uh, I guess... Uh, it just noticed there was something in there and then didn't let me do it. And the box... Man, I can get so many boxes in this thing. It's amazing. I want one of these at home. It would definitely help with cleaning things. Um, hmm. Well, there's a bunch of presents here. Ooh. Cool action figure. Nyeh. It may forever guard the top of that thing. Ooh. That's terrifying. <laughs> kind of reminds me of Isaac from... The Binding of Isaac. There's a bunch of paintings that seem to show off. Maybe it's... I think they were working on, like, a proper game rather than just a Christmas game, which was kind of set in the same idea, I guess. I don't know. Like, uh, you clean stuff, and it's going to be pretty quick. Ah! God, I should really watch out for that thing. It's so scary. Uh -huh. uh, well... This thing is pretty good at just removing things from the world because so far it's just, so far it's mostly just succeeding in making things be away from the world. And I guess that's good. I guess that's kind of what I want as well. I don't think I'm going to get this thing in there, but it never hurts to try, you know? It never hurts to like you shouldn't just give up immediately just because it seems like a task that cannot be done doesn't mean that it is impossible. Maybe if I use my uh trusty mop. Get in there. Get in there. <laughs> uh. Oh god, I've only made it worse. Yeah. I guess this thing might be too big. Oh, this might be interesting. Let's keep doing this. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, okay, there we go. Yeah, I'm... I'm making a tower. <laughs> Oh god, let's see if there's something else I can put. Maybe I can put this little chair in there. Ooh. I should really just continue exploring this area rather than play around with this machine, but it's just so much fun. <laughs> Come on, get in there. Get in there. You s there we go. That's perfect. That's exactly how I wanted it. Nya -nya. Oh god. It came out again. Why? It's flinging me all over the room, which is a bit unfortunate. But I'm sure that if I believe hard enough in this thing, then eventually... God, will you just go away? I like the physics in this game so far, though. They're pretty good. Ah. Like, it seems to detect boxes and stuff and chairs, but not everything, so... Oh, is that dynamite? I'll play around with that later. Um, let's try one of the littler, littler boxes. One of the littler boxes. God, this is going to just be such a mess in the end. It's just going to be disposal boxes everywhere. The game. You... Lee? Uh, eh. That's good enough. No, not an arm. I want the present to be... Well... <laughs> it's in a disposal box. Right, I'm going to... I'm going to see if I can get some other things cleaned up around here. Let's uh, clean our mop a little bit. 
Maybe we can get all the blood out and eventually... Oh, there we go. See the blood sort of stopped. Oh, God. I, I think I broke something. Uh... Oh, it's a little bottle Christmas thingy. Whoop. Can I break this? Yep. Yeah. That sounds broken. <laughs> uh, throwing, it's just awfully satisfying to throw something. Was it one of these? Did I pick them up through the wall or something? Because I didn't actually see it beforehand, so I'm not really sure where it came from. Another Isaac. Some cars. Some Christmas. Christmas. Oh, oh God, that is just great. <laughs> Oh, is that a gun? I want that. Can I use this? Ooh, that looks pretty spooky. Yeah. I'm not very good at using a gun. I'm not really sure what this is. It's inevitably good for something. Maybe it shows off the areas you need to clean or something, but... I don't know. It just makes noise. That's all it does. It's just a noise-making machine. I guess this is like his, uh... Ooh. <laughs> Santa's dungeon. I'll enter that later. <laughs> That's, uh, that seems to be like an area where I want to go. Ooh, a fireplace. Can I go in the fire? No. I don't think I can go in the fire. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, what is in this bottle? Uh, slack Spaniel. Fine quality old whiskey. 54%. Ah, that's not bad. Wait, does that say different number? No, that says 54, doesn't it? Let's try throwing this in the fire. Oh, that made a good sound. I feel I'm fixing it. I feel I'm adding things which makes it cleaner. It's not on fire, unfortunately, though. I wonder if I can throw the TNT in there, though. That seems something worth trying. Hmm. Let's try throwing this guy in there. Slosh O Matic. What is it, Slosh, though? Oh, it's a bucket! Now I can properly clean! Yeah. Oh, <laughs> let's Let's try that again. Let's, uh, actually, oh, Ooh, the bucket is taking me along for a ride. Let's try that. Oh, that is just great. Let's put this guy in the fire. Cleaning. I am now cleaned. Oh, God, where is it? I'm going to have so many buckets at the end of this. It's going to be great. Okay, get the mop. Uh, that's the thing I want, I think. Oh, look at that. Cleaning. I'm the, I am the cleaner man. The cleaning cleaner man who cleans the world. Oh god, this would take forever though. Man, no wonder Santa doesn't want to mop all this up. This would. This is such. No, I cleaned my mop. Jeez. This is about as good as I am at mopping in real life. Like any room, it's just gonna end up with a pool of blood everywhere, regardless of what it was I was trying to clean. It's kind of a sad case of. blood. I don't know. It just always ends up the same way. Can I put out the fire with this bloody water? Yeah. Wow, that's... Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't mean to do... Wait. Hmm. I have maybe figured out a more efficient way of cleaning the world. Okay. Blood there? Yeah. Oh. Uh, yeah. That doesn't work at all. <laughs> that is the least effective way anyone has ever tried to clean anything. Let's try that again. And this time, eh. No, this, uh, this is a pretty sturdy fire. God, the physics are so great because they just make you fly all over the place. <laughs> Alright, okay, let's let's try the TNT. Where, where did I put it? There it is. Get it. Spin it. And throw it. Perfect. Um, I don't really know where I want this to be. Oh! <laughs> well, I got an achievement for it. Uh, I can still look around. Okay, I guess I, was, I guess I was dead. I think my age changed between sessions. Hmm. I wonder if there was a different story there as well. I guess I probably should have read it, but I kind of assumed it was the same thing. Uh, maybe I'll find some more dynamite somewhere along the line. Uh, let's see. I think... Was it there where I... Yeah, this this looks like the place where the TNT used to be. Oh boy. I hope I didn't break anything important. Uh, turn it around. 
Dear Mr. Claus, I oh, got this lighting. I have in my possession video footage recorded in infrared of you along with your gang entering one of my premises via the fireplace. The footage also shows littering and you personally removing my valuable property, milk glass and confectionery items. At present, I am preparing to forward the evidence to local authorities unless I reach, receive compensation for your organization is a sum of no less than $100,000. Uh, Lord Deviant Snakely. That's a good name. Rook is keep. Hmm. Oh god, there were some bottles here. Oh jeez. Man, it's a good thing that I'm now a different character and don't have to worry about the things the previous guy has done here because jeez, this is it's no way to clean a house, is it? Let's Ooh. Can I cut things with this? Eh. Oh, that, that doesn't seem safe at all. I like the sound effects of this game as well. They're quite nice. I'm not very good at cutting things. Let's let's try. Uh, oh god, what, what even is that? <laughs> let's try this again. No, this is not really effective, is it? I think the sword is coming to life. Oh, and it's gone. Okay, well, um, that sword is not something we need to worry about as our little cleaning man. Uh, clean. Ah. So much potential for everything to be gone. I'm just going to continue exploring. I kind of want to clean everything as well, though. But I already made such a mess. How am I going to clean all of this? Let's let's see if Upstairland has some sort of mystical secrets of... Oh, no. <laughs> oh, God. He was tied to the wall with the sword. He was horribly mutilated. That's Santa. What did you do? Okay, go there. Live and be free. Oh, secrets. Oh, no. <laughs> There's just more and more garbage everywhere. That's no good. Santa. <laughs> oh, jeez. Well, he was definitely trying. Does this one have a little crown? Ooh, it does. That's adorable. kind of want to take him along with my cleaning expeditions. Oh, can I take that? And it's all shiny and stuff. But I'm just not very good with things, really. Um, I think I'll just let the next guy clean everything up. It's going to be pretty great uh, when he gets around to doing that. I think um, I'm going to just see if Santa has any hidden magical powers of cleaning that uh, my, uh, my other co-worker was trying to find and failed to do so because he exploded. And um, all in all, it was a bit bad, wasn't it? Ooh, I can't set it on fire, but only for a little bit. Meow. That's cool. I like that. In the fire you go, my candy. Hmm. Yeah, I'm just gonna go. I'm gonna go into Santa's dungeon to see what he is cooking up. Oh, God. How very Hannibal of you, Santa. Because that's the only thing I can think of that did the same thing. Ooh. But if only I could reload this gun with these things and then shoot it at the elf for five achievements. That would be so cool. But no. We're not gonna get any achieves for that. Oh, we found more TNT! <laughs> oh, I have an idea. Oh, and this helps. This this helps. Uh, oh, oh no. Uh, uh, I I will be right back. Uh, wait, actually, what is there? Is can I open this at all? No. Hmm. There doesn't seem to be much going on in here. Yes, I will be back after these messages. I got a different idea. I was gonna do something else. I might do the other thing as well, but first I'm gonna try to see how far I can get with this TNT. Uh, run! Run! No! Mm. I didn't get as far as I hoped. That's no good. Oh god, I just keep getting older, and my name keeps getting numbers behind it as well. <laughs> the careless work or ethic of your predecessor led to his death shaming the company. We require you as a substitute to fill this opening immediately. Perform your duties in accordance with the company. Blah, blah, blah. Your performance will be evaluated, etc. Right, I'm gonna do plan B to get out of this horrible mess. Right, it, it took some setting up, but um, I, I, I think I figured out the best possible way to do the cleaning job. So... 
I made a Christmas pile of everything that might be deemed unclean, and uh, there were some. There were a lot of unclean stuff. Everything that I missed, uh, it's not there. Just imagine, it's not there really. Um, and I surrounded it with buckets, and I feel that if we believe in some great Christmas magic, it, it, I think everything's gonna be okay. Also, this machine doesn't always work very well. Sometimes doesn't grow another bucket, which is a bit unfortunate. But uh, yeah, I'm just gonna place the final bucket over here. And I think if we all just believe in a little bit of Christmas, then I think this cleaning job is gonna be pretty darn tootin' great. Oh jeez, it didn't go as I wanted it at all. Is that clean? Would you say it looks clean, doesn't it? I may need some more dynamite, really. Every now and then the little bucket dispenser dispenses some dynamite as well. But maybe there's still some left over here. That'd, that'd be good. Is this dynamite? No, that's, that's probably some sort of body part. Not really sure which body part, but it looks pretty, pretty body-ish, I would say. That's unfortunate. Let's let's see if the bucket dispenser has any more magical tricks up its sleeve to maybe grant us the final Christmas wish. There we go. Our Christmas wish is a Christmas miracle. Yeah. Um. Hmm. I would I would say this is pretty clean. Uh yeah, I, I don't really think I can really add anything to this, so let, let's clock out. I wonder if there's anything we can do with this. Hmm. Maybe. Maybe not. Who knows? But I'm going to clock out. I think that should be good. Clock off. You stop working for the day. You flee the job, having it left worse than before. Shaming the company and your family of miscreants, you take with you valuable items from the workplace. Fired from your job, you seek to sell the articles... Rooks keep matriarch. Uh, I'll go in shame. There we go. Well, we managed to solve... Okay, let's do that again. But this time, we are going to clean as our 37-year-old hygiene technician. I wonder what happens if I would clock out now. You abandoned the task at hand, shocked by sad things you've witnessed, the failure you've been noted on your record. Aw. I wonder if it's just a different thing every time. No, it's pretty much the same. Okay. I'm going to do some cleaning. Cl cleaning. Mwah. And so, I did a lot of cleaning. And among cleaning are activities such as piling up ten chairs on top of each other. Because there was an achievement for it. Which was actually trickier than I expected. Um, because after, you pretty much have to do it. From where I did it because otherwise there's pretty much no way that you're ever going to reach the top of the pile after a while unless you're gonna make some really elaborate towers around it but this seems to be the easiest method of doing it and then I decided to look for Santa's boomstick because there was an achievement for it and it was behind his closet, and I put it in my thingy because the thing said so, and everyone was glad. And then I decided to get Rudolph's nose, which was just lying about. Might as well take it with me and put it in my little boxy box because I got an achievement for it. And then I decided to put some toys in there. There's like 20 different ones. And with 20, I mean about six, but you only really need to have one of the six different ones. There's about 20 of them probably scattered around, though, and there's a bunch of duplicates. But as long as you got all the different ones, then it should give you the achievement. And then I decided to get some other guns. And again, this, this all have to be different ones, and they all have to go inside the box because there's an achievement for it. I decided to get some decapitated heads. Only heads. 
having just actual bodies in there doesn't work. No, you, you gotta have decapitated elf heads in there because it's Christmas and there's an achievement for it. Some of these are actually quite difficult to find, but as long as you're not like me and accidentally make a gigantic pile of dead bodies and buckets and everything on the front door, then you might not have as much difficulty finding all of them. But there were a couple which were hidden quite well. And after a while, I was somewhat tired of the music because it just sort of drones on the entire time and I was there for probably about two hours even though this video is about 20-25 minutes-ish, somewhere around that time. So I, I grabbed the boombox and I put it in the fireplace, which took longer than expected to burn. But in the end, everything turned out to be okay. And after all that trouble, all that cleaning, cleaning so much you have no idea, sort of getting rid of the bodies, probably should have put them in boxes, but I didn't because I couldn't really be bothered. I still, it wasn't good enough. Your attempt to clean the workshop have all been in vain. You leave with a saddened heart, a darkness and weight that is scarcely lightened by the souvenirs you gathered. Which is all this stuff. And it's all mine. Keeping holidays clean. I'm gonna play around with the chairs some more. Much better. Goodbye, children. Because I cannot be bothered with this anymore. <laughs> uh, clock off. Go and shame. I hope you all enjoyed it. And I hope you all have a Merry Christmas, or whichever holiday you choose to celebrate, if any at all. And if you don't celebrate any of them, then, well, happiness to you anyway. Ah! And a Happy New Year. Assuming you have one of, you know what I mean. Just have a good holiday season, whatever. Bye!